So, whenever you're, hmm, yeah, whenever you're in the full guard, there are three directions that your partner can look to move to counter whatever you're attempting to do on them, right? Um, it's important that you have an understanding of what they can do to counter you so that you can prevent that. Right? The goal of this DVD is not for you to learn my guard system and be able to attack in the same way that Josh Moody attacks. Like, no. Nah. My goal here is to teach you what's happening, show you some reliable techniques, and then give you the concepts necessary to troubleshoot these techniques and positions when you go to do them live. Because... The, the big downfall of learning jujitsu the way I did and the way that you currently are via instructionals and via YouTube is you don't get feedback, right? You go and you watch this technique and it looks super pretty and you're like, that's amazing. That'll work perfect. I can't believe I didn't think about something like that. It's so simple. And then you go do something live to your training partner and they wiggle their pinky finger and you're like, what in the fuck does your pinky finger have to do with this and why doesn't it work anymore? Right? I need you to understand the things that are happening so that you can defeat those things, right? So when we get to the full guard, if Justin goes to put me in a triangle or an arm bar, it doesn't really matter which one, okay? And I just stay here, I'm going to have problems, right? He put me in a position where he's going to begin to attack, he's going to cut angles, he's going to tear my head off. Oh, it's going to be really bad. But if as he goes for that attack, I back up, he's going to miss. Right? His opportunity to attack me is if I stay right here. Right, So he punches one in out, oh, and he got me. But if all I do is, as soon as he goes for that, I back up a little bit, right? Even if I didn't get lost out of the guard, just the submission's gone, right? I could also do the same thing by driving forward. He goes for that same triangle, and I go, nah, homie, we ain't doing that, right? And in this case, he gets so of me because, you know, I did other bad stuff, but like, I shut down that initial attempt just with good positioning. Like, I, I didn't do some, like, oh, I'm not going to get triangle because I put this here and I did that. And, like, do all those things, too. Those are all great. Don't discredit any of that. But if the only thing I have to do to stop you is just go like this, why would I do anything else? Right? Especially if I want to go and, like, headbutt him or something. I'm a big fan of headbutts, but, like, low-key headbutts that don't look like them. Where you just go and you just, ah, that kind of headbutt. I love that. Right? This is good position. He can't do anything.